Hello everyone. Welcome to another exciting episode where we explore the latest and greatest in the world of cinema. Today we delve into the unsettling world of The Substance, a film that has taken the horror genre by storm and left audiences everywhere on the edge of their seats. The Substance is the most talked about horror film of the year, and for good reason. Its chilling narrative and haunting visuals have captivated viewers and critics alike. Joining us today is the visionary director behind this masterpiece, Lena Ngo. Lena has made an impressive mark with her feature film debut. Lena, welcome to the show. We are thrilled to have you here. Your film has sparked countless conversations and debates, becoming a hot topic in the horror community. Many are calling it the most extreme horror film in years. How does that feel to hear such high praise and intense reactions? It's incredibly humbling. I poured my heart and soul into this project and to see it resonate with so many people is beyond my wildest dreams. It's also a bit surreal, to be honest. I never imagined that my vision would connect so deeply with audiences around the world. I never expected the film to resonate so deeply with audiences. Seeing their reactions, both in theatres and online, has been incredibly rewarding. That's amazing, Lena. Your passion and dedication truly shine through in every frame of the film. Let's dive deeper into your journey. Can you share with us what inspired you to create The Substance and what the filmmaking process was like for you? The making of this extraordinary film must have been quite the adventure. We'd love to hear more about the challenges you faced and the creative decisions you made along the way. From casting the perfect actors to creating the eerie atmosphere, every detail in the substance seems meticulously crafted. How did you approach these elements to bring your vision to life? The special effects and makeup in the film are particularly striking. Can you tell us more about the team behind these incredible visuals and how they contributed to the overall impact of the film? It's clear that the substance is a labour of love, and your hard work has certainly paid off. Congratulations on your success, Lena. We can't wait to see what you create next. Lena, the substance is a visceral experience. Where did the inspiration for this terrifying narrative come from? The inspiration came from my own nightmares and societal anxieties. I wanted to explore themes that are both deeply personal and universally relatable. The film tackles some of our deepest fears about identity, transformation, and the pressure to conform. Were these themes you consciously wanted to explore? Absolutely. I believe horror is a powerful medium to confront and dissect these fears. It allows us to face what we often try to ignore. One of the most striking aspects of the substance is its use of body horror. The film doesn't shy away from showing grotesque transformations, making the audience squirm in their seats. These intense visual effects are not just for shock value, they serve a deeper purpose. Can you tell us about your approach to depicting the female body in this way? What inspired you to use such a visceral method to convey your message? I wanted to use body horror to make a statement about the unrealistic beauty standards imposed on women. By showing these extreme physical changes, I aim to highlight the absurdity and cruelty of these expectations. The bubbling and distorting skin is a visual metaphor for the internal turmoil many women experience. The physical transformations in the film are a metaphor for the psychological and emotional distortions women endure. It's not just about the outer appearance. It's about the inner conflict and the pressure to conform to an ideal that is often unattainable. The distorted mirror scenes are particularly symbolic of this struggle. The film seems to critique these unrealistic beauty standards. Was that your intention? It appears that you wanted to spark a conversation about how society views and treats women's bodies. Yes, it was. I wanted to challenge these standards head on by using body horror. I hoped to create a visceral reaction that would make viewers think critically about the pressures women face. The grotesque imagery is meant to be jarring, to force the audience to confront the harsh realities of these societal expectations. 
I wanted to challenge these standards and show the real, often painful consequences they have on women's lives. It's not just about physical appearance. It's about the mental and emotional toll these standards take. The film is a call to action, urging viewers to rethink and question the norms that dictate how women should look and behave. The distress and pain shown in the film are very real for many women. By bringing these issues to the forefront, I hope to foster empathy and understanding. The goal is to make people aware of the damaging effects of these beauty standards and to inspire change. The film is not just a horror story, it's a social commentary on the pressures women face. Social change. Section 5. The personal touch. Art imitating life in the substance. Lena, your own experiences as a woman and a filmmaker must have influenced the making of the substance. Can you share how your personal journey informed the film's themes? The film feels incredibly personal, raw even. Was it difficult to tap into such dark and vulnerable emotions while making this film? Section 6. A Legacy of Discomfort. Challenging Perceptions Through Horror. Horror has always been a powerful genre for social commentary. How do you think the substance contributes to this legacy? The film is deeply unsettling. Were you aiming to provoke a reaction from your audience? Section 7. The Future of Fear. A Call for More Inclusive Horror Narratives. Lena, you're part of a new wave of filmmakers changing the face of horror. What are your hopes for the future of the genre? What advice would you give to aspiring horror filmmakers, especially women and people from marginalized communities? Section 8. The Substance. A Catalyst for Conversation. Lena, The Substance is more than just a horror film. It's a conversation starter. 
What discussions do you hope this film will ignite? The film's ending has been particularly divisive. Without giving anything away, what message were you trying to convey? Section 9 Join the conversation Share your thoughts on the substance Lena Ngo, thank you for this insightful conversation